How many times have you hit a bad shot? <coughs> Only to pull your provisional ball and absolutely stripe it. <coughs> and I certainly know that I have. So today I'm testing that theory. And spoiler alert, we played the first nine holes in four under par, where I've hit one shot and if I don't like it, I can hit another but I have to take the second one if I do that. And that doesn't include chips and putts. So now we've got the back nine. If I could replicate another four under and go eight under, that would be absurd. So let's go make some birdies. Come on. Now, if you watch the ninth hole, I stupidly made this decision to hit a second ball when I was on the green with my first. So if this gets somewhere near, I'm okay with that. It's a back right flag, so I can't really go long. Ooh, I've pulled it. Fortunately, the wind has kind of knocked that out of the air. I'm not sure that's even on the green. Well, I don't want to compound errors, but we're going again. I'm not sure what happened to that one. So we'll try again. Same club, just better result, please. You can tell me off in the comments if you don't think this is the right play. But this is now my in-play ball. Oh, I'm so glad I did. Be right. Oh, it's short. For a moment, I thought it was in and I was going as fast as I could into the flag. Great decision in the end. Didn't work for me on the last, but it certainly has here. My first was on the fringe, albeit a good opportunity to at least make a three, but this is a very good chance of a two. What a read, five under. We've tied the course record already. This is so much fun. Oops. Oops. Well, confidence is sky high, apart from my ability to put the ball on the tee. But I just need to focus on every shot. Absolutely no pressure on this really, and it's quite a tough driving hole. And this back nine is gonna be hard because it's usually downwind, but not today. It's into off the right. So there's a few long holes going straight at that pylon. Hold on. Well, that's a very aggressive line, but it's his holding on. And that's going to be amazing. I've got two opportunities to stick it close from there. And that's prime position. The old mayor's office, it's just landed on his desk and nearly knocked his teeth out. I actually much prefer being up here because I'm on the flat. Being in the fairway over there, you stood like this. Anyway, I've got 112 playing 102, but slightly into breeze. And this is my 105 club, so that should be perfect. Try not to rely on the second golfer who's getting rather arrogant at this point. So if I can plonk this somewhere around the 10 feet mark, we'd be laughing. Hold your line, it's just a bit left and it's short. Got to believe I can do better than that. I don't think that's even on the green, but I want a chance at birdie. Uh -oh. It's further left, much better for distance. Yeah, it might've been a mistake. Fortunately, that's a straight uphill putt. That seagull told me I'd done something wrong there, but I didn't. It's okay, not great though. These are the sorts of things that I really enjoy doing in my spare time. So rather than going to the range, you just come and do different challenges like this. So if you're enjoying them and you feel like you're learning something, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and like the video. It really helps me out. So thank you. I think with a bit of hindsight, I should have hit more club and tried to keep it a little more under the wind, but we're still putting for birdie. I think I've hit every green in regular. No, I haven't. That's a light. Well, I sort of have. Anyway, it's a birdie putt. Won't overthink it. Oh, it's great for line. It's not getting there though. Decent putt, not spectacular. Don't like leaving them short, but from there, I don't think the make percentage is high at all. Tapping four though, that's a tough hole, especially into the wind. Still five under. I'll be very happy to keep old mate player two on ice 
just by hitting quality shots, keeping the pressure off. This is quite a wide open hole, but it's into the wind and 420, so I need a good one here. I struck that well. It was a bit further right than I'd have liked, but it's going to be very nice. Probably just in the right side of the fairway and got a favourable bounce. So no complaints from me. We will go straight to that. Stay in the pocket, player two. Sorry, mate. Okay, that was a really nice drive. I've got 139 to this flag playing 131, but I'm going to play it 139, which is a nice nine iron. Ball's above my feet, so that promotes a draw, and you don't want to miss left. So I'm aiming 20 feet right. That looks good if it's the right distance. Yeah, it is. That actually drifted further left than I thought. I kind of lost it at the end. But it's on the green, about 15 feet. Let's just go make it. Just a reminder that there's no second chances on the putting, so it either goes in or it doesn't. And I see a fair bit of left to right in this. That was not a good stroke. Oh dear. In fact, it was so bad it went off screen. We've still got four and a half, five feet left here. <sighs> Thankfully, going past the hole generally means you get a good idea of the line. That was more stressful than it needed to be. Whew. All jokes aside, we're five under par. We need five more birdies to shoot 59, which seems ridiculous. But we do have two par fives and with old second golfer in pocket, we should easily be able to reach in two on both holes. So maybe an eagle coming down the last few? Stick them out. It's going to be great fun. Par 3 13th then, 135 and a left to right wind that's slightly hurting. So it's just a nice chippy 9 iron. I'm going straight at it since I normally draw the ball and that should hold it nicely against the wind. Tiny bit left of the flag. Yeah, I'm not in love with that, so we're going to have another go. Just got to believe it's not a mistake. Staying it a tiny bit further to the right. Same swing. Like that. That's so good. Be amazing. I've lost it. It could be delectable. Good decision in the end had about 40 feet from down there so could have made three but could easily have three putted that whereas now albeit a lot of right to left but we could make a two here if i don't choke on my words well it's definitely not going to go in at that pace still think it would have been low had i hit it firmer but again it's a par. Not to be sniffed at, especially on the par threes. Right then, if I could deliver a three down this par five, that would be brilliant. 500 yards, but significantly downhill. Got to flirt with this left side with today's wind. I just didn't quite feel comfortable over that. Get over there. It's not great, but it's probably in play. Oh, let's attack. Get out guy number two, brimming with confidence. I don't mind that swing, I just pushed it a bit. Well, that's on pretty much the same line. Well, We'll see, I might struggle to get there in two from there. That's two disappointing shots on the trot. That's a big stroke of luck. This is a lot better than my first, so I'm glad I hit two. Pins directly behind this huge tree in front of me, but I don't have any issues. Got hybrid, it's into the wind, so I might come up short, but I'm terrified of hitting three wood. Oh, that's right again. Struck so well, it's so high. 
I mean, that's okay, but I'm going again. I can do better. Wow, that's on a much better line. It's a bit left this time, but that's going to be okay. Yeah, as misses go, that's a good one. In fairness, my first one wasn't too bad. It was actually pin high. This one's got snagged up in the rough, but it's not too bad. I'm going to have to land it about here, though, because it's all downhill. We have had previous on this hole. Last time I played it, I chipped in for eagle, so let's do that again. Get in. <gasps> Get down there. Yeah, pretty good. Wouldn't have minded being that distance past. However, it's a makeable birdie putt and I'm all about that. Downhill, right edge. This for six under. Rat. Thought I had it. Well, if ever there's a disappointing par, that's it. Well, unfortunately, it's been a while since our last birdie, albeit we've had a few chances. Sometimes putts just don't drop. Simple as that. But got to just remember things could be so much worse. I bang on about this all the time, but I just enjoy playing golf. It's so nice to be out here on a nice day. Hope you're enjoying it too. Thank you ever so much for watching. Tough driving hole number 15. Thankfully I've got two attempts. It's also downwind, which is very handy. Makes it a lot easier. Usually it's straight into the draft. Hmm, not good. That's where we always go, irregardless of wind. So we're gonna need number two. Just going off the boil a tiny bit. So let's just refocus. All good. That's much more like it. That's ripped. Tiny bit right, but that does not bother me whatsoever. It's just going to be a flick on from there. Bailed out by player number two again. My first ball was just in the middle of the trees, dead and buried. Now this is 92 playing 97, so I've got my 90 club, hoping this downwind is going to help me. Be the right distance. Oh it is, never mind player two, he can just have a nap after his glorious tee shot. Hopefully that's close, although I can't actually see it, but it's as good as I'm ever going to do. And replace that. There's the big reveal. And yes, it was definitely the right club. That'll do ever so nicely. What a shot, I played some belters today. It's literally all just the confidence that I've garnered from playing this style of challenge. Straight in the middle or into the flag rather. And that's seven under and it could still be done, although we need to birdie in. What do you reckon? Yeah. Right, just the small matter of 550 downhill, but into the wind. So I'm gonna need me Sunday best to get there in two. Luckily, we've got two drives and then probably two, three woods at it. That's just cutting towards the trees, heading right for the middle of them. Oh, actually, that's fine. I don't think it matters if I hit driver again. Nope, I'm gonna take that. It's definitely inside the trees. I'm afraid my chances of getting there are gone. It's 290 middle, albeit downhill, but it's straight into the wind. So smash this as far down as I can and then try and hurl a chip. Wow, that was as good as I could hit a three wood, thankfully. Yeah, no complaints, just 40 or 50 short at least. Well, in the context of the round, need to get this up and down at the very least. 
and then birdie in for a 59, which would be ridiculous. It's 50 yards, but it all slopes away after this flag. So I'm just trying to land this on the green. So I'm hitting like a 30 yard shot. Just didn't quite carry that far enough. It's a putt and that's about all I can say about it. No prizes for short, Johnny. That should be my inner monologue every time. <sighs> Too hard on that line. A nice aggressive putt though. Can't argue with that. Just a little less pace and it probably would have dropped. And I've not really taken advantage of either par five. Well, I haven't, because that's two fives on them instead of birdies. Never mind, two to go. How good would it be if I could just stiff one? It's 125 on this lovely par three, which is just a nice 50 degree. Nice strike, I just pulled it a tad. Uh, absolutely not. I've somehow managed to go long, which I didn't think I could do. So I don't want that one because that's hideous from there. So please save me. Which he has been doing all day today. It's even worse. Oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. What is happening? Stick around, we're going to need Seve's help to get up and down here. Well, I wish I could have taken this, even though that's hard. But this is going to be very difficult. I don't even know where it is. Oh. Well, it's on the upslope, that helps. I can do this. Just pop it onto the green, let it roll out to the hole. That came out a bit dead. That's going to be a devilish little putt, but I'm going to make it. I am holding this. Lovely putt. <sighs> One more hole to go, and I can reach it as well. Right then, last hole is behind me. I'm pooped. No more talking. I'm gonna try and make a two here. Hope you guys have enjoyed watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you have so you can enjoy some more sublime content <laughs> oh dear well thank goodness for ball number two um, that's left hopefully those blokes have left the course it's in play but I'll need to get up and down. Go right. Not bad. It's all right. Oh dear. Well, I hope you've enjoyed watching. It's six under par in the end, which equates to a 63. Goodbye, hope you've enjoyed the challenge.